When I was in California, I used to have a guilty feeling by driving cars because I was using fossil fuel. So I wanted to do something about it. I had a strong urge to use renewable energy, non-combustion engine. So I came up with an idea of using waste vegetable oil instead of diesel so that sulfur oxide is no longer produced. I had to use the technology whatever friendly available. It is not perfect, but it helps reducing environmental footprint, especially in the development countries like Philippines, where I live now. In the Philippines, people are so poor, they have to use second-hand liquidated engines from advanced countries. As a result, as you can see, smoke belchers are all over on the road. This picture shows the installation of the conversion kit I bought in California. My friend mechanics did all the work. It was for an old Mercedes, so I bought second-hand 1984 300 SD. The installation is finished, already pouring vegetable oil. Collected vegetable oil has to be filtered before burned as a fuel. This is the centrifuge chamber, removes the water from the oil. It has to be cleaned every hour or two. After 8 hours, we can finally filter the oil, ready to pump. Here is the used cooking oil we collect at the restaurant. In California, used cooking oil can be collected at no cost because restaurants have to pay the collector to dispose it. So restaurants are happy if we collect the waste oil. In the Philippines, we have to buy it as used cooking oil has been sold to farmers for feed mix or to street food vendors to reuse it for cooking. It's not easy to maintain an old car from 1984. How many times have I brought this car to this repair shop? I had to fix the air conditioner numerous times, replace the entire transmission gears, rebuild the engine support chassis, etc. etc. Huh? Is it cut? Yeah. Is that one? Yeah. That one. Oh, it's After uh, a few seconds. They will come again. Oh yeah? Two seconds? Maybe 10 seconds, 15 seconds. However, despite all the adversities, it runs alright now and I feel good driving on the new space for oil. <laughs>